Hey everyone, how's it going? For today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a Bowser and Mario surprise fold. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Bowser surprise fold, let's begin by folding our paper in half. You want to line up the corners and give it a nice fold down the middle like you're making a birthday card. Then go ahead and give it another fold by lining up the corners again. So it kind of looks like a bookmark. Then when you open it up, you have these nice little guidelines that show you where to keep the inside of your artwork. Now to begin with this, we want to start by making Bowser. So I'm going to begin right here and I'm going to make his nose. So I'm going to start by just making a curve line just like this, kind of like a sad face shape. Then I'm going to make two little kind of partial ovals that are not all the way connected for the nostrils. Next, let's make the eyes. I'm going to start here and I'm going to make a line that's going to curve down and then it's going to come back here. Do the same thing here, just kind of curve down and then bring it back here. Next, we're going to curve this around to make the eye. And we'll do the same thing, just curve this around and up to make the eye. I'll put a half circle inside each one. Then I'll make another half circle and I'll just kind of color that one in. Now I'm going to take this, I'm going to bring this down and I'm going to bring it up here and I'm going to make it kind of pointed for the eyebrow. Same thing here, I'm going to curve this back, make it kind of pointed for the eyebrow. Starting here, I'm going to curve this line over and I'll do the same thing here, I'm going to curve this line over. Now starting here, I'm going to draw a little line underneath each eye. And then I'm going to bring this line in a little bit more for the nose. Now back here, I'm going to bring a line down and in. And same thing here, I'm going to bring a line down and then in. Now up here, I'm going to bring this line up on each side. And then I'm going to make a couple little points that come down. Now I'm going to make some long kind of pointed curved lines on here for the hair of Bowser. So I'm just going to make some kind of long curved pointed lines on here. And then right where these little kind of points are, we'll add some extra little lines here. Now, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve out. And then over here, I'm going to make a line that's going to curve out. And then I'm going to bring this line down and in. And then same thing here, down and in. Then right here, I'm going to bring this line down and up. And I'll bring this line down and then up here for the chin of Bowser. Now we need to make the horns. So starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to come up to a point and then down. And then over here, up to a point and then down. I'm going to make a line down here and then a line down here. Then I'll make another line down here on each side. I'm going to make a line that's going to curve down and then in. And then same thing here, I'll make a line that's going to curve down and then in. We'll make a line that's going to go down and over. 
Fake line's going to go down and in with another little line on each side. Now right here we'll make a line down and a little curve here. Now, once we have like our basic drawing of Bowser in here, we're gonna open this up and add all the details on the inside. And one of the things we can do is just kind of make a little line right across here. Now, once I open it up, we can start drawing the details on the inside. So I'm gonna start right here, and I'm going to begin by making a line that's just going to curve down and then up. And then we'll do the same thing, just go down and then up here, but don't you don't want to cross that fold. Starting here, I'm going to bring this line up and over, kind of like a smile. And we'll do the same thing here, kind of up and over like a smile. Then I'm just going to kind of start to bring this line down on each side. Then I'm going to add some of Bowser's sharp teeth in here. Now, before we go any farther, I want to draw Mario inside of here. So I'm going to start right here, and I'm going to begin by drawing his nose. So I'm going to go right here, kind of above this fold, and I'm going to make a circle for his nose. Then right here, I'm gonna make a line that's gonna go up, down, and over. And then same thing here, I'm gonna go up, down, and then over. I'm gonna make a little circle here, and then a little circle here. Now I'll just color in a little pupil. I'm gonna make a line that curves out on each side. And then we're going to make a couple little bumps in here for the mustache. For the mouth, I'm going to make a line that's going to go down. I'm going to go over and then up. And then I'm going to make a little line across for some teeth. And a little two bumps for the tongue. Then I'll go ahead and just kind of color in the rest of this. Then right underneath here, we'll make a little curved line. Now starting here, I'm gonna make a line that's just going to curve down. And I'll do the same thing here on the side of the mustache. Bring a line that's just gonna curve down. And then we'll make a little bump for the chin. Starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve around for the head. And then right here, I'm going to make a line that's going to curve up and then down here for his hat. And then a line that's going to come out and then into here. And then another one's just going to go out and then into here for the sides of his hat. And then right here, I'm going to make a little bump right above here for the top of this hat. And we'll make two little curves for part of the circle. Right here on the side, I'm going to make a little curved line for his ears. And then I'm going to make two little just sad faces for the eyebrows. Now, I want to make it look like he's kind of driving the, his little Mario Kart out of here. So I'm going to start right here, and I'm just going to make a little line. It's going to curve on each side. And then I'm going to make some little lines that just curve around here. 
So same thing here, we'll make some little lines that are just going to curve around. I'm going to make little lines going to come down, over, and then up. And then a little curve line here for the steering wheel. Make lines going to curve out and in, and then out and in. Then I'll make two lines that come down. Then I'm going to go out, down, bring it over, and we'll just go up and then bring it in. We'll make two lines that come down and another set of lines right over here. We'll make a little rectangle shape on each side. And then we'll make kind of like a square shape on each side for the tires. Then right here, we're going to just bring a little line up on each side. And we're going to bring this line down on each side. I'll make another line that goes up and over, another one right here that goes up and over. Then we'll make a little half oval on each side. Then we're going to make kind of like a curved shape that goes around here for some of the exhaust on it. And then right here we'll make the circle, and then we'll put the little M for Mario in there. Now, starting here, I'm going to bring this line down and then in, and then this line down and in. Then I'm going to bring this line all the way down to here to connect. And then same thing here, I'm going to bring this line all the way down here to connect. Now, when we close it up, we have our picture of Bowser. And then if you want to, you could always go and add a little line that curves up on each side. And then we could put like a small spike on each side. We don't want to make it go above that fold because if we do, then it's going to interfere with this drawing. But there's our little picture of Bowser. Now, when we open it up, we've got Mario flying out of his mouth with his Mario Kart. And there you go. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.